Your enemies will be right in your own household. Wow, what a statement. Why would Jesus say something so provocative? He wants us to understand what lordship looks like. He's challenging us by suggesting our first priority must be our relationship with Him. And what we will find is that when we make our relationship with God a priority, we become better at human relationships as well. Listen to Jesus' words in Matthew chapter 10, verses 37 through 39. Anyone who loves their father or mother more than me is not worthy of me. Anyone who loves their son or daughter more than me is not worthy of me. Whoever does not take up their cross and follow me is not worthy of me. Whoever finds their life will lose it, and whoever loses their life for my sake will find it. Jesus is not saying that earthly relationships are not important. Far from it. In fact, there are many passages in Scripture that suggest earthly relationships are vital to living out the life God has for us to live. Instead, Jesus is letting us know that as busy as life gets with people and relationships, our relationship with Him must take priority. And here's what's in it for us. By putting Jesus first, we become a better friend, a better parent, a better employee. Because everything that we need to be more excellent, more loving, more insightful is found in Him. We all live very full lives, priorities pulling us this way and that. And today is a good day to stop and reassess how we spend our time. If you're feeling frazzled or frustrated, it could be that you are, as they say, burning the candles on both ends. I want to encourage you to make time to spend with the Lord. Let Him refresh you by refreshing your perspective. Being still and allowing Him to speak with you will shift your entire day or even week.